As kids are getting ready to head back to class, tonight you can check out a new concept for an elementary school in Austin. The first fine arts academy just for elementary school students is set to open this fall, and they are looking for additional students, by the way, to transfer into the program. Kate White, all life for us in East Austin with your details. This sounds like fun. Yeah, it does. We're at Blackshire Elementary School, and they're going to be holding an open house tonight because they really would like to have some additional students transfer into the program. And you know, while these fine arts academies, it's not really a new concept. You have it at the middle and high school level, but this is going to be the first one at the elementary school level, at least for AISD. Now, so here's how it works. Students would receive their regular lessons in reading, writing, math, and science for the first half of the day. Then the final two hours would be devoted strictly to fine arts. Everything from dance, orchestra, digital media, ballet, yoga, and cycling. It's basically 70% academics and 30% fine arts. Students who track into Blackshear are automatically enrolled in the program, but they are accepting 75 new transfers beginning tonight. And, but we wondered, what if students who go to the school aren't really interested in doing this type of program? Sometimes you don't know you don't like something until you actually try it, just like when we're trying new foods. And therefore, we give our students that opportunity for experience. So, of course, parents can transfer their students out of the school if they choose. But if you're interested in checking out the Fine Arts Academy, there's an open house tonight from 6 to 730 here at the school. Staff will be on hand to help you with the transfer process if you choose. Now, this program has been in the works for the last two years here at school. They've been doing a lot of professional development with the teachers to get them ready for all of this. But the students are essentially losing two hours of academic instructional time during the day. So coming up in the next half hour, we're going to talk to the principal about that and what kind of impact that could wind up having on the students. For now, we're live in East Austin. Kate Wydaw, KXAN News. Yeah.